Welcome back to another B to the 7 Quick Bits. Today I want to talk about getting the most out of Twitter and your Twitter profile. Some of the things that I'm going to talk about and I'll walk through a little demo with you are just little tiny adjustments to get the most out of Twitter itself for you to get the most awareness and to take full advantage of the platform. All right, let's get started. So I've pulled up my Twitter profile as an example or demo and I'll walk through this. So one of the first things you want to look at when you come to your Twitter profile is the profile picture that you have. Um, try to keep it professional. If someone were to see you on the street, at least they'd have an idea of who you are. You know, you can also get creative with it, get fun with it. The second thing that I like to look at is the header photo that was in that is in within the background that you see there. This area is a great opportunity for you to showcase a little bit more of what you do, what you offer. Once again, another area for you to really get creative with that space, but also know that visually you can communicate so much in that area as far as what it is that you do. For myself, for example, get across the other social platforms that I'm on, that I'm targeting and engaging audiences with digital and social solutions, and that I'm a Twitter chat host, so that people will know that right up front when they visually see that. Jumping down to your name and account handle, if you will, so I've chosen Bernie Fiesnager, which is my name, so that when someone sees this, it's very consistent across all the channels that I'm on. I also included the hashtag after it, after it to show that, yes, I am the Twitter chat host of Digital 360 Chat, and my handle is B to the 7. Um, this handle is something that's very consistent across Twitter, Instagram, Pinterest, and now Clubhouse. Getting into the bio itself, keep in mind, this bio is searchable, so you know this will show up in Google and search results. So use keywords, be very targeted, be very specific, and try not to use too many hashtags. I'm just using the one, but I try to cover the basis that I'm a host, um, kind of what I do, targeting, engaging customers again, relationship marketing, and community building. Um, be very specific and you know have fun with it, but make sure you do put something in your bio so when someone comes to your page, that is what they see. And keep in mind, you know. First impressions do make a huge difference, so these things that we're talking about are very relevant when people come to your profile. I like to have my location on so that people know where I'm located geographically, so that they have an understanding of at least, you know, when I'm tweeting, when I'm in a Twitter chat, they know, okay, it's Bernie from Louisville. Kind of puts a little, you know, emphasis on where I'm at and what part of the country that I'm in. Um, the link part is very important. So, you know, you can link to your website, you can link to other promotional items, you can link to LinkedIn, whatever it may be. I chose to use this tool, Linktree, which is really pretty cool. So I'm going to click on it just so you have an idea. Within Linktree, you have the ability to set up multiple links to different areas. So, you know, right now I've got links to my other social channels, I've got links for my email program, to my website, um, you know, for other Twitter chats that I've been on, craveable predictions that I did for 2021. So it just gives you an idea of the capabilities that you can really have more than one link once, once you utilize this link tree capability. Moving down to the pin tweet. Now this is one that is underutilized in my opinion. This gives you the ability to pin a tweet. So for example, you can go to the three dots gives you the ability to, and right here it says unpin, but I don't want to do that, but you can go to any tweet that you have and you can pin that to your profile. So this is a great way to extend your profile, to have something that tells more about you, to have a promotion, say you have a book or something that you want to promote, a Twitter chat if you want to promote, um, you know, it could be anything. It's also a great place to also have a video introduction, but really a way to really talk about more who you are, showcase who you are, with this pin tweet. And now down to the last part of this, you know, what is the content that you're posting and, you know, who are you supporting? What value are you providing? So, you know, I look down through mine, I see that I'm promoting, you know, quite a few people, but I also have my own post. Uh, I try to ask in, intriguing questions. I try to, you know, show some of the digital stuff that, that, that I do so that you can understand, you know, what it is that Bernie Fiesnager does, what is the value that he does. Here's another example of one of the tweets from today. You know, in the, in the spotlight, um, Digital 360, I focus on specific individuals to know more about their career. This one was Lisa Beats from Content Marketing World. And it just gives you an idea of, you know, the type of content. But, you know, when people come to your profile, 
this is what they're going to see. So, you know, try not to offend, avoid politics. Um, if you're in the digital space, make sure that you, you know, stay within that realm. Show personality, be genuine, and, you know, be transparent. So hopefully these little tips helped. Um, you know, these are very easy to accomplish. Get in there, make the changes, see what happens. And if anything, you know, engage and have fun. So with most of the videos that I post, there are action items for you. So for today, go to your Twitter profile, take a look at the things that I um, walked you through in the demo today, see if there are any areas in which you can make changes and change them. Pretty easy, they're not very hard to do, but they will make the biggest impact in the long run. So, everyone have a great day. If you have any questions or any comments, anything like that, um, definitely follow me, um, follow the YouTube channel. I've got other videos out there. And if you need digital and social solutions, check out b2the7.com. And from there, I do help brands with targeting and engaging their audiences with social and digital solutions. So if you have any questions, um, ask away. If not, take a look at that Twitter profile and make the changes. Have a good day.